came into this third. Scoring a 15.233. Well, this is her favorite piece. Stoop up to the top bar. Back down there. Nice. Big Jaeger there. Up. Oh. Full twisting double back there. From the start. We'll get a medal. But if one of these women can beat her, she won't get the gold. Yezheva, most well known for her work on the balance beam, but also quite good with these nice combinations on the uneven bars. She really has three terrific combinations in this routine. Pirouetting skills to releases. All of these just rack up the bonus points. There's a one and a half turn to a brandy down to the low bar. Another nice transition and good form. A couple of times she was past the handstand in some of those pirouettes. It's important to be within 10 degrees of the handstand to get awesome. And next out, Zinia Semenova. We've seen so little of the Russian competitors at this tournament. It's as if they're not even there. That really is amazing. So little Russian finalists. But that is amazing gymnastics. Only person in the world does that catch-off skill, but manages to giant out of it. But had to use bent arms, muscle away through, clipped her feet on that. So packing in the difficulty, but certainly areas that the judges could capitalise on. Leader after qualification with 16.325. 16.3, the new mark from Liukin to beat. Oh, well, she just about nailed that landing. It's sufficient to be able to get in the first positions. Coco Surumi had 14,775. Today, he bronze in the general. Execution. We will see, but she should, if she can go through, be able to beat most of the rest. Clean turn into the endo. Good full pirouette. And another one into the invert endo with a full turn. Lots of difficulty. There's the Pike Jaeger, and now it's that difficulty added together that gives her this big start value. But she has had little errors. Ooh, a little bit dead and slow on that swing. She covers it well. Nice half turn. One and a half pirouette this time. Needs to lift and keep concentrating to the end. The good double straight. Lovely dismount. Just a little bit out of control in the middle, but she will be delighted there. Chris, she changed her routine from the U.S. Nationals back in the summer and added a more difficult combination, which has served her well here beautiful amplitude on that transition now watch this move here hop with a full twist right to the release this is important nailed oh. it boy she caught right on the end of her fingertips her execution is terrific good form solid cast up the handstand just the dismount oh yeah Nice set. So enjoyed watching this gymnast yesterday. Incredible body type. And also using that stoop in and out. They've really got to nail these handstands and that pirouette was great but was late, wasn't it? The last half turn only just happened in time. Better on the full turn and again. Gosh, she's packing. You see, she is linking moves really ambitiously. 
makes it quite a short routine as well when you do that. Another wonderful double straight this man. Of course, a woman always in medal contention. Uh, Svetlana Horkina. This has been her event. She has just dominated. And there's just really no more you can say about her on the bars. The originality, the combinations, the style, the risk. I mean, it's all there. The only time she doesn't win the bars is when she falls. And to be honest, in the last seven years, that has happened only rarely. Oh, yeah. Just put it in the bag. Kicking off this women's A bar final, then it's Sin from China, qualified with a massive 15.975. Olympic champion from Beijing. And so smooth. And watch this original combination, and that was fingertips, wasn't it? But her swing is so smooth. She's grown a bit since we saw her in Beijing, has to change shape. But another fantastic release. The front somersault straight down to the low bar back up again this is wonderful work clear circle just needs to big dismount full twisting double back well she has laid the ball head down now this is such a clever routine it's quite short but everything counts here's the first one scoop into shaft down to pack solder so we've had the moves all linked bit short on that handstand but here we go with the turns one turn two turns this one's a one and a half which makes it worth even more and then up into a big high catch -up. all she's got left now is the dismount you only need eight moves and she's got them there lovely double straight not a flicker on that Nicely through the release. And again, the Jaeger somersault. Heather Downey. So on, half turn to catch the top bar. Full pirouette right in the handstand position. This is good work. Full twist in double tight. And just a little adjustment on the line. And this routine has bags of energy. And that turn did finish in handstand, didn't it? Really lots of energy, super tight body. Look at the height on that catch if she was sky high. Very deliberate with her actions and another huge release, but bent her legs as she swung through. Only a tiny deduction, another very good pirouette. Flies down to the low bar. She's very positive with everything, isn't she? Really strong. Just a slight bend of the legs past the low bar as she winds up into the dismount. But no deductions on the landing. The height of that dismount was incredible. Yeah, she can produce some very difficult combinations. The stolder, full pirouette on the low bar, up to the high bar, uprise into the Kachev. Back up to the handstand, has hit the vertical, Stolder, Pike Katchev, that's called the downy, after her. Toe on, Strala Katchev into mix, into the Ejiva, very difficult work, and back up. Impressing the audience, impressing the judges, finishes with a full twist in double tap, and a super routine from Becky Downey. Martin strongest qualifier, Simone Biles of the USA. And that forward circle. Into the half turn, up to the high bar and the Kachev. The toe on, pirouette, into the pike Kachev and the pack salto, linking the difficulty. Cleaning the handstand and the transition up to the top bar. Kicking into the giant and the impressive double double nails it as always. What a start to this uneven bar final. Fluency and ease. 
loop in and out with full turn. Stalled a shot up to the high bar. Back down immediate again with the half turn. Just a little bit of leg form loss on the half turn there. Stoop half. Now this is the difference. She puts one pirouette and another pirouette before the massive Jaeger somersault. And so that's her third difficult element in a row. Into a turn, into the dismount, half in, double back out. Not much. Terrific routine here. Nice and high. Very dynamic swing. Here we're coming into her signature move. This dismount, she stoops in, goes to eagle grip, and straight into the dismount. Vem agora nas paralelas outro grande nome do esporte. Na final por equipes, ela sofreu uma falha nessa prova. Uma companhia se hoje ela acerta. Vitória Cobova, que falou... Barbara Wett. transition, the Ginga somersault. Back somersault with half turn. Oh, a little waver there. Flexibility in the shoulders for those pirouettes required. Six, six. She did in qualification, so let's just see. Super turn. Oh, that was clean, wasn't it? Immediately into the next element. Down, immediately up again. Oh, lovely clean work there. The half turn. Big high pike Jager. Swing turn, that was a tiny bit short, but very nice pirouette. Into the full twisting double back, just a tiny hop. Buena suelta. Saben que va a hacer el cambio exacto. Hace un cachet y luego cambio inmediatamente a la banda inferior. Da bye, da bye, le dicen. Es algo así como vamos, vamos. Ahora, la recepción se ha quedado. They do seem to have a very positive relationship, don't they? They're very often seen chatting and smiling together by the side of the apparatus, but when she gets onto the apparatus, it's game face for Lukin. Packing in complex skills. Ginga release, one of the highest releases of, of all the gymnasts. Exercise. Building up for the dismount. It's a new dismount. Double front half turn. It's good, but uh, hopefully the judges can't see the, the untidy tuck position. Alicia Sacrification. Yes, what a gymnast she is on this apparatus. Swings so well. Straight onto the high bar. It's a nabby over. Watch this combination. Stole it. Straddle catch up to mixed grip. Into the edge of it. Straight back up again. And the pack salto. Toe on. Van Leeuwen up. 
Taiwan, full pirouette, kicking into the dismount, full twisting, double tuck, beautiful routine from Nina Dewell. She's done it again. Zero five for gold. This is a very big series. Two releases. And this is the one that came to grief last night. Whoa, she went for broke. Now, come on, she must keep concentration. More big skills to come. And again. Now, this was where we had a few problems last time. The full pirouette into the dismount. Full drifting double back. Wow! Fantastic, Beth. What about that? She smiled. Great Britain. Beth Treadle going for a medal. No, she has to go through cleanly. Lovely turn. Good full pirouette. Into the Markloff, into the Ginger. Two of the most difficult links already. But these are the big risky moves. The Pike Catcher, one more. Has to catch mixed. Does so. Down to the low bar. Mustn't let her confidence. And concentration waver, this takes a lot of power. The half turn up to the top bar, hits a good handstand, into the dismount, full twisting double back. What a performance, what an answer to all the problems.